And this is a great night for me and for uh, everybody who liked the movie, uh, particularly in Asia, they helped make this movie. Uh, I wish them uh, a happy uh, new year of the snake. Everybody gets lucky. Uh, <laughs> uh, here's the thing. I, I think it's a miracle that I could make this movie. And then I carried the anxiety for a very long time, for four years. It's a philosophical book and an expensive movie. So sort of the worst combination, most scary one. How and cool was it to have the first lady announce that you had just won an Oscar? I, I was sort of hallucinating when that was happening. You know, and in the, uh, the course of a hallucination, it doesn't, uh, you know what I mean? You don't, it doesn't seem that odd when some other, oh, look, a purple elephant. You know what I mean? Oh, Michelle Obama. It just seems like uh, it's natural because the whole thing is so unnatural. No, I mean, honestly, I was just asking these two guys outside, like, was that Michelle Obama? The fall on the way up to the stage. Was, was that on purpose? Well, Absolutely. Was it a fall? What happened? <laughs> I, what do you mean, what happened? Look at my dress. I, <laughs> I tried to walk upstairs in this dress. That's what happened. Is there any other historical figure that you want to portray in the future? I can't think of any right now. Because I, I need to have a lie down for a couple of years after this one. No, I can't think of any. I really can't. No. It's really hard to imagine doing anything after this. Playing Fontaine, having to connect with the darkness of life and... I think maybe more to the point, the unnecessary suffering that human beings can inflict on each other. I would have loved to have gone home and forgotten about that every day, but you just can't because it exists, and it exists for millions of men and women throughout the world. I think this film changed me because it made me more compassionate and more aware. Well, you have the Oscar, you have the Grammy, two to go for the EGOT. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How are you going to do it? I don't know, maybe I'll do like a HBO special like Beyonce did. And then <laughs> And then uh, Tony, I'm not so sure. Like, maybe one day, maybe someone might oh, want to do a musical. musical.